What is up you dudes and dudettes? Welcome back to Life is Strange Part 2. Uh, someone asked me in the last video if I could please not talk over the dialogue, which I totally understand. So that means I'm going to talk a lot now. So just skip like one minute ahead if you don't want to hear me ramble about a couple of things. So, first of all, I got new glasses. They're red. Can you, can you see them? Hello? They're different. They're well, mostly the same frame, but a uh, different color. And I got a new clothes, which you might be seeing throughout the videos, but this is one of them. I don't know if you can see them, but it's fucking human, you know it. And I said, hey, yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that I'm also very excited about. I got like a couple of new stuff. I might be showing them off. I, I like funny shirt. Yeah. Uh, if you're interested in it, I'll just put a link below. I'm not sponsored. Uh, I don't even have enough views to be sponsored, but hey, whatever. <laughs> uh, go. That's basically it. Let's get into it. Oh, by the way, I also, which is a good tip, it works for me. Uh, I'm trying to lose a little bit of weight because, you know, if you're not careful, I'm going to get a double chin and all that. It's not, not pretty. Uh, I put a picture of Terry Crews next to my computer. Here you go. Whenever I feel like eating or snacking, uh, I look at that and he just corrects me. It's, it's strange, but works. <laughs> you could put it in your wallet as well. I think Terry Crews has a, this actual picture in his wallet. So if it works for him, it should work for us as well. So uh, let's continue the game. <laughs> oh my God. Oh yeah, I remember we are here. So uh, what happened last time? Uh, we found out we could rewind time. It's been longer yeah. for me than for you, probably. Well, no, not if you're watching this on the same day. Ah, uh, whatever. Mm. Okay, okay. I need to go to my room and return warrants. Go to my room. Drives. Okay, what's this? Look, oh yeah, I the remember Prescott this strange dormitory. Selecting, Good Lord. Yeah. Nathan's family owns my dorm. Nathan's family owns our dorm. That's cool. Hello, Alyssa. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Well, let's make become oh. better friends. Hi, Max. Yes. How are you, Alyssa? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better oh. off reading chiclet. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Solo? She has a weird voice. For somehow, why would I look inside? Glad to see our campus is eco friendly. Don't ask me. Hello, can I come through? Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. You know it, girl. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, oh. Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. Nice. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> oh, she's going too far. And you can just walk right Since you out. know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, she is why don't you go fuck your selfie? We oh, yes, Victoria. Right I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Here, go here. Oh, damn it. It's a letter. Hello. How do I Samuel, you look happy. There goes with your Samuel job. Da Vinci to paint the window. Damper with the bucket. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Oh yeah, there's like a pretty sprinkler awesome. system here, right? Uh, oh yeah, you use. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, oh, no. water oh, on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Well, then you can go through now. I'm still not. None shall pass. Capiche? Oh no, you got the bucket. What do I do? No. How do I tamper with the bucket? Can I have your ball? Give me. Why doesn't no. it work? Give me the ball. 
Oh, hey. Awesome. How are you doing? There's a squirrel over there. Can you see it? Hello. I can't talk to you. You look really unhappy. Whatever. Is there something we can use? Huh? I must have missed something. I should rewind. Okay. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Can I do it now? Yeah. How does the tempering work? You make the handle loose. Okay, let's see if this works. You're still pretty close. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, let's do this on. So it'll be what in the, the right hell? spot, maybe. Are you kidding? Yes, yes, I'm kidding. Oh, is it gonna work? We got a cutscene. That was pretty easy then. How oh, is it not falling off yet? But hey, whatever. No way! No fucking oh, okay, way! The there goes your cashmere. Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Samuel talks in third version. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I drive. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Bitches. She can let me through now. Uh, I wish you knew about it. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? That was totally my fault. This comfort her. Maybe we'll be friends. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. She ain't got her friends around well, her now. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Although she doesn't deserve to be my friend. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Oh my god. She called her friend sluts. That's not nice. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourselfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Sorry, I'm talking to the dialogue. Au revoir. That was easy. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find her. She played me. No way, girl. Did you see that paint drop? I totally played on her. Oh my god. Hold on. I just found the keys my boyfriend's been looking for for days. Oh my god. Let me send him a picture. That's so funny. Hilarious. He's gonna be so mad. They weren't on my speakers. Oh my God. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. I don't know what's with room 17. I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. Even on the 21, you can still learn how to operate firearms from Eki to Sudovka. Young guns use fun, safe, perfect replicas of plastic. Uh, yeah, it's a bit strange. I, I think it's a bit of a gap between America and Europe. Uh, shooting guns. Uh, I really can't imagine that stuff. Man, today. people here are merciless. Same, not sorry. I must have, no matter how you like each other, one slip up can change your life. See Kate's video for proof. This is like a sex tape. That would be horrible. Juliet, read this week's edition of edition of the Blackwell Totem. Seriously, who cares? Oh my god, the people are ruthless here. Taylor is a slave. Everyone is so nice. Oh, there's the missing person poster again. 
Don't be a zombie, I'll try. Oh, this is my room. I have to get the stick, right? The USB? I think. This is nice. Home room. sweet home. My favorite cocoon. I get that. Why don't we just stay I in here? I love that mom sent cookies? me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. Ooh. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Happy birthday, Roxy! Can't believe it's been 80 whole years since you were brought to us. Max, your principal, sent me an email saying that you told some tall tales about a Blackwell Hunter student. Is this true? Sorry, guys. I thought it was funny. The principal said that this was a serious false charge and that he's worried you're telling story. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. Mom, the principal is telling people already? What douchebag? The fuck? It's horrible. Just Hard stay inside, eat cookies, and don't do anything. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. I have a feeling that's gonna end a lot better than whatever we're gonna do outside. Hey, there's a note here. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. To Max or Hoon Wei concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are a graphic life-altering controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care for the most discriminated for... This is like, um, just movies, like torrented. I congratulate you on your taste and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Okay, those sound like pretty cool good things. Both photo, myself in the mirror. Go fuck yourself, he. There you go. You took enough photos. Seeing on, on those walls. Look at the photo. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial. Yeah, hey, got a, an achievement. Red eye. That's cool. Can I play some music? Play the fucking music, my boy. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? You look really I'm going right. to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Are you twins? Is it just me? I think they look right, right? Cartier, Bresson, Joyneau, Hamilton. The greatest. Oh yeah, this stick should be in here, right? I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Camera porn. Porn makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. You don't have a lot of emails. Oh, when you search for camera, okay. Max, thank you for your email. Oh, thanks for your email and a copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also rather have a eclectic collection of TV called classic and fucked up films on a fat flash drive. If you ever want to check them out, thanks again for the help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? You push the button. That's how it works. What's this? Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Do people walk into my room randomly. Hey, girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need a bag, just track me down to my room. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. I would really not appreciate it if people went into my room all the time. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. God damn it. Now I have to go but I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Isn't that where we're supposed to go? Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. That's nice. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. Can I've locked Dana phone? in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Nice. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, Mason. Uh, Juliet Mason. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. It's Watson? Hey, let's rewind. Hey, hey. 
Oh, yes, Mac. Juliet, this is so stupid. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. This is I didn't even think you I knew my name at all. Who wants to be uh, a millionaire? Of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Yeah, we got that much. Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits she it, she didn't even see the evidence. Straight She's to just hell. Believing Victoria. Yeah. I swear I didn't do anything. Leave me I alone, Max. Victoria Get a clue. I know the proof is in her. God, do we have to go talk to Victoria now? No need to go there now. No, we don't have to talk to Victoria. Um. Um. What do we do? What's in here? I can't go in here. Can we go in here? At least that's an alarm from this century. Let's not ring the fire alarm again. <laughs> oh, here's Victoria's room. Good thing we made amends with her. Her room is pretty stylish as well. Um, are we sure we want to snoop in here? She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. Are we sure? I hate you, Victoria. We want to do this. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Yes, that's nice. Well, we can always just rewind. Rewind if we get caught. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom, this is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast. And just get take the a picture of the screen. Here. So sad to inform you that I totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention to Juliet that I saw a nasty text from Dana's on sex phone. Dumbass, believe me, um, I expect there to be a room ramp with you. Juliet deserves this for slitting sex away from me. As for Dana, who gives a shit? Get your poker, make your bets now. Who is gonna die? I put my bets on, uh, on neither, cause I'm uh, gonna, you know, stop the whole fight. <coughs> from happening. Printed, there you go. It's a bit strange to use another person's printer when you can just take a photo of it. Tick. This better convinced Juliet that Dana is innocent. Victoria's really not nice. She's not gonna see me walking out of Victoria's room. Hello? Juliet, read this. Hey, person conveniently coming up with an of email. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. This whole school is strange. Almost done. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though, Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. She has magic yeah, earrings. Okay. They just stay up. I gotcha. Sorry, I just had to mention that. Good. Uh, it's not nice that everyone just barges out oops, in each other's room. <laughs> Don't mind waiting here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all of the cars. <laughs> the more I text, the longer I take. There's a point there. 
up to Warren. I wonder what kind of dude that is. Sounds nice. Fuck this shit. Oh. Ow. Huh? That hurt. Damn. I better rewind. This is nice. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Fuck this shit. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Oh, no, it's not good. Uh, what do I do to stop you from turning well? It's not weird that I teleport. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. I don't know what's worse. The whole nice, glass is broken awesome. or getting a ball in the back of Thank you. That was close. Jock assholes. If I was a member of the Vortex Club, they'd never pull that. The Would Vortex Club doesn't member? want to sound They're like smart. a fun club. We should hang out more. I now I have to finish this stupid book. To put my phone off. Oh my god. <sighs> Sorry. Hello, Zachary. Get Steven lost, anyway. hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. What's wrong with being a hipster? Nothing wrong with expressing myself. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Oh, this is a hard one. Oh my god, sorry about that. Take a photo so I have evidence or intervene. I don't know what she's gonna... Let's take a photo. Because I get to keep my items, right? You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So now you go better intervene. figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Do we get to keep the photo? I think so, right? Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. It, right? I could rewind and try something different. Let, hold on, let me see. How do I check my inventory? By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Bye, okay. Oh, this is all the next episodes? Huh? I don't know where my photos are. Where the fuck can I see my photos? I don't know, whatever. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. Uh... Well, it doesn't look like I get to keep the photo and she's not harassed that badly. Even after relief. So I think take the photo is the best option here because we don't make much of a difference. She won't be happy with us, but... I think the photo might be more important. Why couldn't do both? Damn it, Max. You're horrible at multitasking. <sighs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Live Stream. Man, I should have done something. That guy was an asshole. How could Zach something. and Victoria do that to me? Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? 
Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. Everyone is such great friends here. Hello, Come Warren. over here. Please. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. I was totally No problem. Take it, Max. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Not bad looking. Very old school. Very awesome 1978 card. to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. Only You're 60 in the miles. time, Warren. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Oh, we should have taken a photo. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. <laughs> Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Uh, sure, I think. Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone. Everyone in the dorm enjoyed it. Which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. Yeah, I don't know. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Sounds horrible. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Oh my god, my boy. Can a sensitive love high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Mike really loves those vampire movies. I don't know what it is. Is there vampires in it? He's seen it. How so? Sensitive usually means won't be having sex with you. Oh, God. Nice. You need a sensitive woman to kick your ass. If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. Is that bird wearing a t-shirt? Kind of looks like it. I don't know that anymore. I need to talk to somebody just to get it out of my system. Yeah, some weird shit happened, Dr. Happen, Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. Warren seems cool. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Oh, he's not gonna believe us. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one uh -oh. of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Answer me, bitch. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, bitch. you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what, give you a stern lecture? Nobody, nobody lectures me. Everyone tries though, <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. That's nice. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're Max. telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Oh my god. Hey, leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do. Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore right in the bathroom! <gasps> Max? Hello? Chloe? No way. You again. Go! Go! Oh, oh, I got this! You yeah, definitely Max. don't got this. Get to do that! Get out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! That was horrible! The security guard was just going. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, Fuck and Max. thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. 
So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. So I Please, the girl. Court. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. That's pretty rude. Probably I'm does. sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Yeah, we are, to be honest, if we left her. I mean, she kinda helped us, but we helped her too. No, she didn't know about it. It's be like, hey, I pulled the fire alarm for you when you were threatened by a gun. Broken. Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. The atmosphere is quite nice in this game. I must say. Although I don't agree with some of the options. But hey. Logic uh, doesn't always win in games. And then you might get the excuse, oh, she's overwhelmed by the situation, but she can just rewind. So there goes that one. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. Home shit home, oh, that's nice. She sounds happy with her life. The bird. Hold to another universe. That's nice. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Step Come in and close the door. I know it sounds Put real nice. music while I medicate. Medicate. Smoking a joint. Whatever. Okay. So, guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, I'll see you in the next day. I'll try to upload more often. And um, yeah, I'm gonna finish Frimbo because I really think we're close to the end. Oh my god. It's almost done. I really like that game. So, oh my god. Okay. 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 That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, yeah, any tips to make the video more watchable? It's much appreciated. Uh, other than that, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, bye bye. Breakfast! <laughs>